Hi, welcome back to Mama Lori's Kitchen. Today we're making chicken marsala. I'm going to first start off by showing you the ingredients you're going to be needing to make the marsala wine sauce. First, marsala wine. Heavy whipping cream. Chicken broth. Olive oil. Brown gravy mix. And a stick of salted sweet cream butter. The other ingredients that you will need for the chicken will be the chicken that will be sliced and cleaned, also mushrooms that will be sliced, and almond flour that we will need, or white flour that you will need to bread the chicken. Okay, first things first, we're gonna take the chicken and we're gonna prepare the chicken. And basically we take the chicken cutlets and just clean them. I like to clean the chicken off and slice them a little bit thinner. I'm very particular with my chicken. I like it nice and clean. So we just have that. Okay, so this is four pounds of chicken cutlets sliced thin and cleaned. And um, I cook bigger because I have a bigger family, but you could always reduce this whole entire recipe in half if you have a smaller family. But this is four pounds of chicken cutlets sliced. Now we're gonna move on to the mushrooms. Okay, so here are the mushrooms. These are 24 ounces worth of mushrooms, okay? And we're gonna take them and we're just gonna slice them. Okay, just like this. And then I'm gonna go ahead and finish these up and then we'll move on to the next step. Okay, so I sliced the 24 ounces of mushrooms, and now I'm gonna take a half of the stick of butter that I have, so that's four tablespoons of the sweet cream salted butter, and I'm gonna stick it into my pan on like medium high heat. I'm going to wait for that to melt a little bit. And then once this melts, I'm going to put the mushrooms in here and we're going to saute them until they're lightly golden brown. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and cook these. It'll take a little bit, probably about 10 minutes to get them exactly how you want them, which is just a light golden brown. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead 
and come back in a few minutes and we'll check back in with the mushrooms. Okay, this is five minutes in, and as you can see, that's why I use a lot of mushrooms, because mushrooms reduce like almost a, a half of what you put in here, what it looked like. Um, at this point, I am going to turn the heat all the way up to high, and the last five minutes, I'm going to cook it on high to try to get rid of um, some of the excess water that came from the mushrooms, and trying to get these a little bit more brown. And then when the five minutes are up, we're going to take these mushrooms out and use the same pan to then um, cook the chicken. So we'll be right back in five minutes. Okay, so that extra five minutes on high, they took all the water and the butter is gone. And there's your light golden brown mushrooms, nice and sauteed. And you're going to take them out and just place them in a dish and put them to the side. And then we'll move on to the next step, making the chicken. Okay, so this is how we do the chicken. This is my first time I'm using almond flour. I always use white flour when I make my chicken marsala, and please feel free to do that. I started a kind of a low carb kind of keto diet on Monday, so I'm trying to make this a little bit keto friendly by at least exchanging out the white flour to almond flour. So basically, all you're doing, you don't have to egg it or anything. You just lightly breading this chicken. It's that simple. Actually, this almond flour breads really nicely, actually. So I'm going to finish breading all this chicken, and then we're going to go ahead and fry it in the pan in a few more minutes. Okay, so I have this on a medium high heat and I just threw in a half a stick of butter, which is four tablespoons. And then I'm going to put olive oil into the pan. And this was a quarter cup. chicken I'm going to brown the chicken And make sure you just don't flip it until uh, the side's a little light golden brown before you flip it.
Okay. Then the golden brown on both sides. We're going to go ahead and take them out. Okay, so this almond flour for the first time that I used did cook differently. You definitely have to reduce the heat, which I did, and you have to keep putting oil because it browns a little bit differently. We do have the excess over, and you would have the same with, um, with white flour, but you wanna keep whatever you have left in the pan as is. And then you're gonna take your chicken broth And you're going to add two cups. <laughs> Sorry for the smoke in the camera. All right, there we go. So you're going to take two cups of chicken broth right there. And then this is Marsala wine. You're going to put two cups of Marsala wine. And this is heavy whipping cream. You're going to put one cup of heavy whipping cream. And then the secret ingredient, brown gravy mix. I'm going to go ahead put in two packages of brown gravy mix. And then we're going to stir this up. It has to get to a boil. And then once it gets to a boil, the consistency will start to change and it'll get thicker. So we'll be back in a few. Okay, I put the heat up to high. The way it can reach a boil. And just for like two, three minutes and then I'll reduce it back to medium high heat. And you can see it starts to change. Okay, so it's so on medium high heat, and you can see. Some of the brown gravy is still trying to um, dissolve, but you can tell the difference. At this point, what you're gonna do is you're gonna take the chicken, lower it down to like, I have mine on three, which is like between simmer and medium. And you're gonna start just putting all the chicken in here. Okay, so I got the chicken all in here. And then, let's not forget those mushrooms that we made. So we're gonna go ahead and add all the mushrooms. That's fine if you just leave them on top or if you wanna just push them in just a little bit. It's not necessary to um, 
mix them in because all the chicken's in there. So I'm just gonna go like this. It's gonna be good. So this is on, like I said, um, the heat is between simmer and medium. So like a low medium. And I'm gonna just let it cook in here for 10 minutes and then it'll be ready to go. So we'll see you back in 10 minutes. Okay, so 10 minutes in, looks good. So we're just gonna make our plate now. We'll take the chicken with the mushrooms. Put it on the plate. I'm going to put another piece on here. Keep the mushrooms. Then I'm going to go ahead and add more of the Marcella wine sauce. And then you have to top it off with fresh grated cheese. Hope you enjoyed this meal that I've prepared and I'm hoping you will try it out. Please subscribe and like and thanks for following me and I hope you guys all have a great day.